Well, hello there. Welcome back to Rocket Craft Season 3 with me, DJ Haribo. It's been a hot minute, hasn't it? Yeah, sorry. Life has been very hectic over the summer and one thing after another between work, having to upgrade the operating software on my Mac, which I use to do all the video editing and bits and pieces, it's just meant that I just have not had any time whatsoever to make any videos, which I am sad about, but things are calming down now and I've got everything organized and we are back on the server in a hole. So it's gotta be a bit of a recap for you these next couple of episodes as I try to catch up on what I'd been up to while I've not been putting any episodes out. And as you can see, we are down near the bottom of the world, somewhere near my base. And I decided that, you know, cause I'm living in a swamp and you know, I am a bit of a, a bit of a goat. I wouldn't say I'm a goat, but I'm a bit of a goat. I thought I would have a go at making a Doc M77 inspired tunnel bore. And well, obviously, you know, who doesn't like diamonds? Now that we're not using diamonds as our currency on Rocketcraft, we can mine diamonds freely en masse and not feel guilty about breaking the economy. And also, why is there iron down here? I didn't realize that you could get iron this far down in the world. This is literally at bedrock layer, but apparently you can find iron down here. So if we take a quick look at this, uh, diagram that uh, one of the Minecraft devs made after they updated the world for 1.18. The ore generation distribution chart here shows that yes you can find a small amount of iron all the way down at the bottom of the world but that's not really why we're here. We're here mainly for the diamonds because I just want to know how many diamonds can I actually get from making a tunnel bore machine. So a little while later I have built said tunnel bore and well, a bit of a funny story. I didn't have enough slime to actually make this uh, the way it was made in the tutorial. So I instead opted to use honey box and I thought, well, I better better check in that that, that could actually work. But now, now I'm drowning in slime now that it's all dug out. So here is uh, the video by First Dan Josh excellent tunnel bore for bedrock edition it works amazingly well and uh, we are about to give this thing a test run but like i say uh i had to use honey box because i didn't have any slime at the time or very very little and um so i reached out to him and asked could i use honey blocks and he got back to me really quickly you know which i am very grateful about and he said yeah uh, I'll test it quickly, he tested it, and apart from a few slime blocks that have to be specifically above the TNT launcher dispenser thing, we can use honey blocks. So I had a bee farm already, so that's all good. We can just get on with killing all these slimes now. And yeah, like I say, ironically now I'm drowning in slime, so I could have made it out of slime in hindsight, but that's the way it goes. So a big thank you to uh, the creator of this tunnel bore. Like I say, I will link his tutorial in the video description if you fancy giving this thing a go for yourself. It's actually not terribly complicated, pretty easy to build. Uh, you just need to dig out a big, big space at the bottom of the world to be able to build this thing. So I'm just gonna quickly shoot around and put a few blocks of TNT into the dispensers because uh, I don't want it to go wrong and blow up and I lose a bunch of TNT. So I'm just going to put in a few for now and we'll give it a little test and see what happens. Um, in typical DJ Haribo style, you know, it could go completely wrong and just break and blow up and that, that would be sort of par for the course. But uh, if I could just stop with the slimes already. So the way you work it is you just open the uh, trap chest there and it launches everything. And it looks like I forgot to put a few TNT blocks in some of them. But uh, the ones at the front here is the ones I'm testing at the moment just to get it going. And it seems to be working. Back when I recorded this, we didn't have 100% TNT drops. 
but we do now in 1.21 so this thing gets even more cobbled deep slate and tough blocks than it did before and like I say the slime are just relentless in this area here I I did not pick a good area to build this uh, this tunnel bore in to start with because clearly there's some some slime blocks here and they are just overproducing like crazy and like I say I'm now I'm now good for slime blocks very very good for slime blocks so uh, let's give it another go so open and shut and away it goes and like I say it all seems to be uh, blowing things up as expected which is great lots of tough lots of cobbled deep slate no diamonds yet and did I mention about the slimes down here they're just so annoying they're just non-stop I just cannot get away from these slimes so uh, we're still in the, in the process of testing, but we've got now TNT in every single dispenser. So there's seven in total, and uh, this is what you have to watch out for. It's very rare, but gravel is a thing, so you have to be mindful of that, because if it lands on that last one and the TNT can't go all the way, it will blow up your machine. Likewise, you do have to be vigilant for lava like this. So as you go in, you just want to just fill this stuff in and block it off and try to get rid of it all. But on, on the plus side, at least it, it does a great job of killing all the stupid slimes. Here we go, guys. Payday. We found our first diamonds using this tunnel bore. So uh, there's at least two, and I can't quite reach those. Let me just quickly block up. Should have bought some scaffolding, really. Is there a... Is it just two? I think it was just two. But, you know, it's a start. It's a small start, but it's a start. Oh no, there is a third. I still can't reach it. Yeah, just the three. Oh well, like I say, that's, that's not a bad start at all. I'm pleased with that. And like I say, I'm gonna keep this running for a little while and see where we get to. I would actually love to see if I could get this tunnel bore all the way from one side of the world, because I am based practically all the way over on the east side of the world. I would love to see if I can get this thing to go all the way to the other side of the world, like the permanent part of the world, which is another, well, it's, oh, look, some iron. Um, it's about, 6,000 blocks away at this point, maybe ne nearly seven, 7,000 blocks. It, it, would, it would take an astronomical amount of TNT, but uh, I've got a pretty good creeper farm. It's just, can I be bothered to mine all that sand? Because obviously on bedrock, we don't have TNT duplication. So we actually have to get our TNT the hard way, which I'm not opposed to. I, I would just like to point out, I. I think, you know, TNT duping is not a good thing, personally. That's just my personal take. You can come after me in the comments if you disagree. But I just don't agree with it. And, you know, if you agree, fair enough. If you disagree, also fair enough. But me, personally, I just don't like the idea of TNT duping. I don't think it's an intended game mechanic. But, you know, also, on the other hand, sand isn't farmable, so that's the other way to look at it but anyway from one big giant hole to another even bigger giant a hole we're over in the gaming district where a lot of players have been very busy mining away and digging out this huge hole for us in this very specific area where we have got a future project planned and that is a game inspired by none other than tango tech's decked out too. We're going to try and build our own version on here, like a bedrock version. And yeah, this is the area we've chosen. It's sort of above a deep dark, so possibly wardens. There's a few cave spider spawners, which were part of a mine shaft, which is very useful, so we could implement them. There's another spawner over there, that's a spider. A couple more of the cave spider spawners that were part of the mine shaft that is now mostly gone and there's even a skeleton spawner over here so lots of options to uh, take advantage of in this area 
that we could implement into the game and the various levels. As you can see, it's a rather large hole, but we have rather grand plans for a pretty big uh, game. But we're going to go into a lot more detail about that when we actually get to that. I don't want to get too ahead of myself. I just want to quickly show off this giant hole and just acknowledge that uh, a lot of players put in a lot of hours digging this lot out. I will credit them when we get to that stage. But just for now, just wanted you to just take it all in and just have a quick look and see. This, this area here on the end, this is still to be mined out, but uh, don't worry, it'll be gone in no time at all, knowing this lot. And uh, yeah, then we can get down to the nitty gritty of actually starting to lay out some plans for this. But like I say, it's a thing for another day and we're gonna come back to this when we're ready. And while we're in the gaming district, I thought we'd pay a quick visit over to Posh Jerry and his pot smashing game that he's made. It's such an amazing concept that utilizes the new uh, terracotta pots in Minecraft. They're not new now, obviously, but back when I recorded this, they were. And he's got some instructions here. Smash and dash. It's kind of like a lucky dip, but it's got some interaction and a bit of skill. It's a bit like a carnival game where you've got to throw something at something to get something. <laughs> Sounds simple, doesn't it? But yeah, basically you pay a coin block and you get a snowball and you need to smash one of the pots and then you get to keep whatever is in the shulker that was in the pot. So yeah, it, it could be anything really. I'm, I'm intrigued to find out what exactly Jerry's put in these things. I'm going to have a couple of goes and see what I get. But um, yeah, he's got some troubleshooting instructions there at the back just in case you're your pot contents doesn't flush down properly. So let's grab my wallet and I have got some spare coin blocks here. We'll have a couple of goes and we'll see what we get. Always put the wallet away safely. And I just wanna point out what an amazing job he's done with the interior decor here. Look at those, the, the mini pots, the mini pot blocks and the, it's like a waterfall. It's beautiful, I love it. And here are the pots. It looks like some people have already had a go. And yeah, this is so you can't go any closer than this. You've got to be able to throw your snowball from back here. So let's give this thing a go and see how we get on. Let's put a coin block in the chest. And we should get a snowball very quickly. Nice, nice. Jerry's a, Jerry's a bit of a whiz with the redstone. And so let's have a go. Can we get that pot up there? Or that one over on its own? Or should we go for one that's a little bit closer? Do you think they're gonna be better prizes or worse? Well, we hit the target, that's that's a good start. And then I think the idea is push this button here and it will flush everything down. And then we get our prize pop up somewhere. So let's turn that off. Hello, Jerry, I would like my prize, please. Oh, there it is, it popped up behind you. So what have we got? Oh, it's, it's a, a pottery shirt. A shelter pottery shirt. Well, I mean, it's a free shulker box as well. You've got you to remember that you are getting a shulker box as well. So, um, yeah, nice. Well, like I say, it's a brilliant concept for a game. And I can't wait to see if uh, we get another chance to play that at another point in time. But while we're over here, just quickly, let's take in... The gaming district as it was six months ago uh, because it's very bare bones at this point but there is some games being started and of course you know bringing back the old server favorite of watersheep down so i was afk as you do over at one of my farms the drown farm and i came back and i found this sign what could this mean you you ask well it means that uh, the person that was tagged has tagged me and yes I mean I, I know you know when you say AFK you are a sitting duck so some would say I had it coming but this is the first time I've actually been properly tagged this season obviously I always start off with the tag but now now I have been actually tagged so um, we we need to uh, do something about this we need to send a message 
that this this sort of behavior will not be tolerated. And it just so happens that I have an ace up my sleeve. Remember, remember Humphrey? Yeah. <laughs> well, I've been holding on to him for a little while, and now I have just fulfilled my requirements of having Humphrey by taking my last screenshot out of five over at our brand new food lottery, which we will be showing off later in this episode because we're gonna do the food lottery again. But in the meantime, it's time to get some revenge. That's right. So I didn't I didn't take kindly to being tagged while I was AFK, and I know exactly who the culprit was because the person tagged before me was none other than Wells. So of course the way that the Humphrey game works is that whoever has Humphrey currently has to take five screenshots of uh, various interesting locations around the server and then they choose who they pass it on to. So I have chosen to pass Humphrey on to Wells. Sorry, but not sorry. Right back at the food lottery we've got a group of players that have all met up and we're going to get our first food lottery of the season underway in just a few moments where we're all going to get a random food uh, chosen for us for the week and then we have to eat that and nothing else but that and lots of fun things are about to happen. Humphrey's on fire. No! Bring any cactus. <laughs> Did you bring any? Oh, Did he's only cactus? got three hearts. Oh, <laughs> has anyone got any cactus? No. There's, Not there's, a, there's, a, ca there's a cactus <laughs> shop. There's a cactus <laughs> block. Yeah, there's a cactus shop that sells buttons if you need them. Any cactus? <laughs> yeah, that's a great help. <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, I just, oh. oh. I just fell in this big hole, James. That's hey. nothing to do with me. Damn. I've done that. Mobby hole. Whoa! <laughs> I think I might die. Oh, I'm on half a heart. Jesus Christ. She just How? Get shot. Yeah, because I have practically no armor on. Like, one flame arrow can practically kill me. You naked bitch! <laughs> hey, look at my new outfit. Ooh, so oh. pretty. Look at that. The, nice. the royalties in the house. Oh, you look so good. Is this an Arendelle? Special. Oh. I it's like special. it. Special. <laughs> very nice. nice. That's what happens when you change your costume for the kids and forget to go back. <laughs> 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 well, you look good. So it's fine. Okay. Looking good. Ah, so right, well, we are you it's ready good. for the food lottery, Nana? Yes. I don't know what I'm doing, but sure. I heard Did that you you're going first. You didn't do it last year. <laughs> Do you want to do a brief explanation, James? Yes, please. Can do. Yeah. So every week we will convene over here. The machine will choose your food for the week. Oh dear. Oh, oh Jerry, are you all right? Do you need help? Nah, that's fine. I wasn't going to come anyway. Damn. <laughs> anyway. Will stay. anyway. So yeah, every week we're gonna all come over here on a Wednesday night and we're all gonna let the machine choose our food for the week. And then okay. once you've got it, you've gotta eat nothing but that food type for the whole week. Oh boy, okay. And you've also got to do a couple of uh server quests just to show that you've been active in the world. Okay. okay. Not not tributes. <laughs> Actual server quests. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, so uh, we do have Turtle wanted to be first. All right. 
Yeah, you go get get the rotten flesh out of the way for yeah. everyone else to so, push the button <laughs> and find out your fate. Oh, yucky! I didn't think about rotten flesh. Yeah, I love this machine so much. <laughs> you say that now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, true. What's the command of this thing? Carrot. Oh, carrot. Oh, that's not oh, bad. That's not bad. I got a carrot. Right, don't eat that carrot. Put it up in the uh, yeah. frame. Take your coin block. If you can, that is. They're a bit high up. I might not be able to reach mine, James. <laughs> 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 Who's Luke doing one for? Me. Oh, you Who's are that? playing, aren't you? What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Honey. Honey. Yeah, that's all right. Honey. No. Just... <laughs> no. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Where? What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Where is it happening? You? <laughs> what has just happened? I don't know. <laughs> Why do I have the tag? James, I don't know. I don't but I don't care. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> How? I, you weren't even stood next to me. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, what are you doing to that? Did that just come out of the machine? Sonic, look. No, look at the floor. No, look at the floor. It's Behind magic. You. Behind you. Sonic. Sonic. <laughs> Behind you. Here. Behind you. Here. In front of us. Oh, James. Oh, oh, oh James. <laughs> James. The Disney. James. Look at the quiff sticking out of the top of my head. <laughs> I, I, I honestly, you might actually kill me here as well. Oh, no. I won't kill you, mate. Um, no! No! <laughs> <laughs> I love this machine so much. <laughs> she don't want to watch back that video either. The way I set it up, that was only like... Sarah's wearing one of Jerry's hats. It, it was in a randomizer, so you only had a one in six or one in seven chance of that act dropper being activated every time the button was pushed. Look at your head, Oh, bird. no. It's so it so wasn't going to go off every time the button was pushed, but one in seven and... Uh, Somehow, I the know. second push, Luke, Luke doomed you. Ugh. Technically, it's Luke's fault. It's been a long time coming, to be fair. I've avoided it for a while. <laughs> it's not even Luke's fault. She wasn't even standing anywhere near it. <laughs> she, she got egged into it. <laughs> <laughs> Where have you gone, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think I was laughing so hard? <laughs> well, did you see I it pop was, up, Sarah? I was standing here and I saw it. I thought you were here. I thought you were here. I ran Jerry. round. I ran round. I <laughs> you from this. <gasps> oh. I did it on purpose. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> the betrayal. The betrayal. <laughs> Bad lady, bad lady. <laughs> nasty lady. You're a nasty lady. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Watch you guys suck. <laughs> <laughs> I could have got away with that till James's episode came out in six months' time. <laughs> I didn't actually see it. I didn't catch that bit on film because I was too busy watching Luke getting the, the honey bottle and catching that. And I turn around and Sonic's like, why have I got this? What? <laughs> nice face. Shall I push it button then? Shall yeah. I just uh, go for the rotten flesh? Yeah, get yes. it out of the way. Get all your bad luck out of the way in one go. <laughs> no rotten flesh. No. Why is it going on for so long? I don't know. <laughs> oh, Sonic, it's the bottom one. There is a one in three chance. Oh, no. Berries. Oh, it's sweet berries. I don't have That's any okay. of these. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a bad night for Sonic, everyone. <laughs> right, I have to do Alison fourth. Apparently, she has to be fourth. Don't ask me why. I've got berries awesome. around my house, I think. 
I don't try being nice to me now. <laughs> <laughs> I've taken them though. Thanks. <laughs> oh, what's happening? You disguised getting? yourself as Jerry as well. <laughs> You're so sneaky. Ron Flesh. <laughs> Is it Ron Flesh? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought the Ron Flesh was in the bottom one. Oh, I guess uh, Alison is not going to be pleased about that. Gosh, darn it. What did she get? She had Rotten to go flesh. forth. Oh, she flesh. had to go forth, yeah. I've wrote it down. Lobo has to be sixth. So whoever wants to get their one next hasn't gone. Number five. Gosh, darn it. Yeah, you can okay. be number five, Nana. You want to go, Nana? Go up. Okie doke. Can I do Lobos? What's what? Okay. Yeah, you can do Lobos. Don't tell Alison that I, I got that, like that I was the one that pushed the button. Because like, oh, well, what if? Because like, what if Lobo gets a bad boy? At the end? You you want to get double the trouble. But at least Alison's taken one for the team. No one else can get rotten flesh now. Well, look, she got suspicious too. Oh, yeah, mushroom stew. I got mushroom, mushroom stew. stew. <laughs> mushroom stew. My thing here. Not the worst, but Nana, you're right the way over this end because you were a late entry. Okay, now what do I do? Take the yeah, take the coin block. You also get a coin block per week for taking part in this. All right, jump. <laughs> no velvet. <laughs> oh, thank you, darling. <laughs> <laughs> Right, well, this could be interesting. Turtle, you eating you're gonna, you're gonna do Lobo. Right, this is for Lobo. All the bowls, Nana. What's that? The bowls. The bowls, yeah. Mm -hmm. The bowls. See it speed up then. Ooh. Was that just me that noticed it speed up? Oh, it was fine for me, mate. Oh. Lobo got bread. Bread. Not bad. <laughs> Staple Mexican food. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> so. <laughs> oh. oh. What just happened there? Who was that? That was me. Oh. Not me. <laughs> it was Luke. <laughs> I can tell by him giggling. <laughs> That's a good job. He supplied me with a shulker full of totem. Luke, you're a dick. <laughs> you, can you do this to Lobo? Yeah. Whoa! Look, man! <laughs> oh! oh. I wonder if Sarah's respawn point was set over here. No. no I, all I know is I better touch this bed too because it's a little dangerous around here. It is yeah, it's well, about to no, be. it's okay. It's about to be. It is spousal homicide. <laughs> so it's okay. It's, it is. Uh, you, it know, is you don't have it's a beard on. As long as you're not wearing a, a beard, you're, you're good. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Spousal homicide is okay, Nana. Oh. I so, did have a Jerry head on. So, yeah, Luke <laughs> can kill Sarah, but then Sarah can also kill Luke. I think she deserved it. I'm just going to pull that out of her. I guess somebody else can draw next. Were you when you got tagged? Yes. I, oh. I'm good in that, mate. <laughs> I wasn't I'm sure. going to slow that <laughs> down. Fine. <laughs> Oh, so one. who's who's caring for the camel now? Is that you, Luke? Yeah, yes, it's Luke, Luke yeah. is now guardian uh, of the Humphrey. Oh, Humphrey. Poor Humphrey. Here's all, here's, here's all the stuff that I picked up for you, or someone picked up for you, but Thank one, you. One, one, one box belonged to me, though, so just a heads up. Thanks, mate. I didn't help at all. I have a thing. <laughs> Someone was watching me, waiting for it to be spoiled. Yeah. <laughs> hey. All right. Thanks, Beats. Oh, that's Terps. I mean, you know. I was like, dang. 
toxic. No, I'm <laughs> <laughs> I'm new to their friend, like, their partners. <laughs> If you, if you had a, it wasn't a even Luke. Hotel, <laughs> you could then kill them. Was that not Luke that killed you? <laughs> it's my other partner. It was not. Oh no, it wasn't, was it? <laughs> it's my no. Canadian boyfriend. God damn it! Because <laughs> I was wearing a beard. <laughs> oh, oh, that Sarah. was a quick one. <clears throat> Baked Quickie potatoes. What's that? Hey. Blueberries. Oh, Slayberries. Slayberries. I'd rather have that than mushrooms too, but well, okay. you've only got to carry like, you know, three stacks of things around with you just to eat. A stack of bowls, stack of each type of mushroom. Oh, okay, okay, that makes sense. Oh phew. Yeah, don't like... make them up all in one go. Just make them as you go. <laughs> yeah, make them as you need them. Save your inventory space. Thank you. I'm like, good lord, there is my spot. Let's pray for whoever gets rabbit stew, if anyone does get rabbit stew. Oh my god, I'm things. telling you. Yeah. <laughs> and, and they don't stay once they're made. Right, who should we do next? Should we go like along the board now? Should we do... Yeah. Them? I'm afraid to go over this black concrete oh, here. I don't know. Yeah, we'll do... DJ, you need to go. Because I'm here. DJ. I'll do me because yeah. I'm here. Okay. And then we'll go along the board for the rest of the people that aren't here. It is nice to see a real face. Please not rabbit stew. Please not rabbit stew. Please not rabbit, rabbit stew. stew. Please not rabbit, rabbit stew. stew. <laughs> I never knew we could actually eat honey in this game. Mm, it's yeah. not me. It's raw meat. Raw beef. <laughs> raw daddy's meat. I'll take that. <laughs> 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 it could have been a lot worse. Okay, who wants to push the button for Jay? Who wants to take the responsibility? I'll do, I'll, I'll, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. Go for it, Nana. Okay. I don't want to be held responsible. I've already pulled rotten flesh out for Alison. <laughs> but then again. Okay, let's do this. You just killed Dominic. <gasps> no. I just saw Dominic. that. Dominic is at my base. Big money! Big money! <laughs> no whammies and stop! Hey, look, there's a head though for it. You're on Ducky yeah. Head. Why are you giving me head? What toe? is it? Because I don't know how much you love heads. Big oh, potato! potato. Big like potato! Oh. oh, that was the other one. If you're in this country, does it say jacket potato? Can you just throw that to me quickly, Nana? Go no, to it you? doesn't. Yeah, oh, oh, okay, it doesn't. Right, okay. What are you doing? It says baked potatoes. Potato. Yeah, <laughs> and that's what it should be. But for some reason in the UK, our cookies are now called biscuits. Oh. Which makes no sense. Oh, Nanny, oh. Right, again. I thought oh, someone man. just <clears throat> named a stack of cookies and gifted to them. Eh? I didn't know they'd changed to biscuits. Yeah, this no, thing is biscuits. So I made some fresh. Fresh biscuits. Yeah. Oh, Fresh biscuits. Yeah, but yeah, but they're cookies to us. I know. I know they're cookies. That's the <laughs> how absurd it is. <laughs> Any other type of biscuit, fair enough. Yeah, it's not like it's a, a digestive cookie. or a bourbon. <laughs> Ain't no custard cream. Exactly. Are we I was going through these all in... these biscuits with the Americans I... last night. I hadn't heard of any of them, Sarah. Oh, I didn't no, know no, what a jammy actually. dodger was. What? Oh, well, thanks for the mushrooms. Shall we? Um, the people who aren't here, should we put their rocket block in the frame below? Because then they still need to cut and get it. Yeah. That's why. I'm yeah. Up. Can I put it right below then? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I just, I just gave it to DJs. Yeah. Where's Lobo? Oh, that was so kind. Appreciate the mushroom. All right. All I want you for glitz. I want you for glitz. <laughs> right. You want to roll for glitz, do you? Yes. Yes. Okie okay, okay. Okay, okay, there we go. I just did this the other week and won $200 doing big money on 45. <laughs> it was exciting. Now I'm mm -hmm. like wanting 
It's not the same there. Uh, hi, is it, Nana? Cook one. Give that cook one. Shrimp good. soup. Ooh. That's definitely That's, the weird That is so good. What did he get? Cook mutton get? for glyphs. What'd you get? What'd you get? Yeah, cook one. Ooh. Ironic for coming from a native that eats mutton. Yep. <laughs> Right. Oh, I had, I had one. I had one last night. It was pretty good. Mm. Sonic, do you want to do ice? Yeah, I was oh. going to do gauge. I'll do ice. Oh, okay. oh. All right, Sarah, you can do ice. Sarah loves the ace. The ace of space. Oh, see, I just heard that piston activate down there, mm -hmm. Sonic. So it would have gone off then that time as well. <laughs> Don't worry, there was only the one tag in there. <laughs> one. <laughs> one the one to roll them all, that one. <laughs> yeah. Raw mutton. Raw. That's not too bad. It's funny how the cook one and the raw one are in the same place. Mm hmm. Right. So right then. For he was hoping point. that he gets something bad. It would be raw funny. And <laughs> raw and <laughs> This is for watching darts. Yeah. This is what you get. Rabbit stew. Oh, it's the bottom one. It's the bottom one. Dried kelp. That's terrible. <laughs> Dried kelp. Excellent. I mean, sorry, Gage. <laughs> <laughs> Tough one, Gage. <laughs> Can't win them all, mate. <laughs> yeah. Oh, right. Mobby. I think Go I'll then. do this one. Yeah. Oh, it activated again. And again, yeah. Yeah. It it's Triple considering pack. it's like a one in seven, I think. Okay, this might not be what terrible. What's it going to be? Is that raw or is it cooked? Cod. It's cooked cod. Oh, it's yours. Fishy. Who wants to pull for cherry? Jerry. Jerry should pull for cherry. Jerry's yes. not here. I'm not, I'm not here. Why? Where have you gone? Why? I'm in the I'll end. Do. I'll wow. do it. Go on, oh. Nana. We'll just nip back, Jerry. Hey, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>, buddy. <laughs> What do you want? Salmon? What do you want? <laughs> yeah. Who, who's it for? It's for Cherry. Um, apples for Cherry. I'm sure she wouldn't mind apples. Who is this for? Cherry. 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 Oh, 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 cherry. Cherry. Cooked pork chop. Oh, cooked pork chop. Ooh, nice. Nice. Yeah. Lucky Cherry. That's a good one. Who, who, who am I doing here? Uh, yeah. Cherry. It's like third from the end. Cherry. Okay, there it is. Okay. Who wants to do for muscle? Turtle, you want to do yeah. muscles, don't you? You like muscles. Yeah. I love muscles. I'll do muscles for once. Get the guns out, mate. <laughs> Sun's out, guns out. <laughs> oh, it's a long one. Sure, sir. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, rabbit no. meat. Cooked Ooh. rabbit. Oh. Nice. Oh. Hey, at least it's cooked. Yeah, that's yeah. true. And one for Ricky. Go on, yeah. Sonic. Who's doing Ricky? Don't talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> you are dead to her, Sarah. <laughs> Shame. Shame. What is that? Beetroot. Is that a beetroot? <gasps> beetroot. It's a beetroot. Oh dear. A beet. Well, everybody got I mean, food to get home. Alison's definitely the loser this week. <laughs> 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 Followed closely by Gage. <laughs> Nana's not got the easiest time with mushroom stew, but there's definitely worse. And then, well, well, it, honey's not easy, I guess. Unless well, if you, someone if sells you've got it, a farm. Alison sells it, don't she? Yeah. Right. You guys 
Did you, did you even put spider eyes in, in here or no? No. no. Should have. Should have. No. no chorus Should've. fruit. No spider eyes. No puffer fish. And no poisonous potatoes. I think chorus fruit would be hilarious. It would have been hilarious. Imagine. Imagine hey, trying to build. <laughs> Maybe for the last week we'll throw it in there. Be just nice. For a laugh, but... Be nice. Okay? We're neighbors. You'd be nice when I see you tomorrow. Okay. Sarah's name is definitely getting changed in the Discord to Nasty Lady. <laughs> <laughs> Nasty Newt. Nasty Newt. I'm the tax man, it's my villain art. What are you talking about? Hello. <laughs> Still one more guy, guys. Did, did, did someone pick up an axe? Because I, I lost my axe. Uh. Uh, no. No, has it oh. gone under the ground by yeah. accident? Uh, probably. Well, probably. Or it yeah. might have gone in the portal. Oh, I so. Oh, yeah, check the portal as well. Uh, Yannick, yeah. it's your turn. Push the button. Go, see what go Yannick, go. Let's pray. Everyone collectively pray for Yannick that it's not yeah, rabbit it, stew. Yeah, it went through the portal. Rabbit stew. A rabbit. <laughs> Pesky <laughs> oh, look at the speed. Oh, it's sped, it's sped up a bit. What's it gonna be? Raw salmon. Hey, at least you Canadians eat raw salmon for a living. <laughs> Pick, pick up that that's just, that's you, racist. Yeah. <laughs> those are mine. Those are mine. Those, those are mine. Are they? I was looking. Yeah, I bought those today. White terracotta. Yeah. Yeah. That, my bad. That was on me. Right. Well. Uh, yeah. That wasn't too bad, was it? No, it was Unless, great, James. It was great. <laughs> Someone got tagged. And, <laughs> and yeah, the camel got killed. <laughs> <laughs> and Alison got rotten flesh. It's, it's been quite the been night. Just a perfect <laughs> <night>. <laughs> Absolutely perfect. So there you go, guys. That was uh, a quick recap of some of the uh, stuff that we've been getting up to uh, six months ago on Rocket Craft Season 3. And, you know, I'm going to try and keep the episodes coming. So keep your eyes peeled for those. And like I say, we managed to pass on the tag, we passed on the camel, Sonic fell for my devious trap with a little bit of help from Nasty Newt, <laughs> and uh, yeah, uh, the camel might have died as well, and I didn't catch that on camera, but yeah, naughty tell. So yeah, if you did like it, be sure to subscribe, and I will see you for another episode of Rocket Craft very soon. So take care, and bye for now.